To start, cut the string into six separate pieces. Then, tie a knot at the end of all of the strings to make it look like a bouquet. After that, me me measure out a quarter cup of mm, salt. Ah! Uh, uh, okay. Then, measure out a ha cup of water. Then bring the water to a boil. Boil. Add the salt to the water. Wa uh. After that, pour the, the the super saturated solution into the tupper. After that, try take the string and spread it out with the knotted end in the wa- uh, oh. Then, leave the salt solution in an undisturbed place for a few days. Although ours didn't quite work, it should have looked something like this. Once a solution has its maximum amount of solute, meaning no more solute can be dissolved, it is considered to be saturated. However, if the solution is heated, it can handle much more solute. Once it reaches its maximum saturation while heated, it is considered to be super saturated. Once it cools, there is much more solute in the solution than there would be if it hadn't been heated, so the solution is very unstable. To balance out the saturation, the salt begins to escape and crystallize, creating a stalagmite. Multiple stalagmites can create beautiful salt sculptures, such as the one seen here. Thank you for watching this video.